my trailer is made out of rust and there is a little bit of steel underneath the rust and that steel is cracked here where this hole is rusted through this top part there is the most disturbing part because that cracked while I've trailered the boat home and the way it's bent up there at the top tells me that that beam had been flexing so it was stressed while the boat was being trailered that roller went in that bracket up front and I had to cut the axle for the roller to get the roller off because the roller had rotted and collapsed a bit this is where the wood boards that the boat sits on attach to the trailer the bunk boards and these two front pieces are pretty much okay although this one is bent a little bit for some reason at the back these are a lot worse because this part of the trailer gets submerged in salt water when the boat is launched and gotten back on the trailer and it's rusted to be very thin I can bend it with my thumb like that and this one is even worse it's just paper thin out there towards the end and it's very easy to bend with my fingers and this is all that holds the bunk boards on the trailer so I'm starting my repairs by sanding the metal um, getting some of the rust off so that my welds can stick to bare metal and here I'm starting the repair welding a steel strip on the top of that C channel to close up where the first crack had broken it I don't really know how to weld I just <clears throat> bought a welder and practiced on some scrap until I thought I knew what I was doing this is a precision adjustment to get the front roller to fit and I've got some grease on the axle for the new roller and that's how you hammer both ends on that axle at the same time I made these to strengthen where the bunk boards attach to the trailer at the back and I'm welding them to what's left of the original supports there's a lot of metal towards the back so hopefully with these welded on it'll strengthen that a bit and there's my other welds for the C channel now I'm putting the bunk boards on the trailer I'm marking where the bolts go through and I'm using a chisel to make some little hollows in the bunk boards there otherwise the head of the bolt would make a point source of stress that would crack the hull with the bolts recessed like this then the only thing that comes in contact with the hull of my boat is the wood here I'm chiseling another spot up near the front and while I was working on my trailer this happened there's this billionaire that likes to shoot off great big rockets near where I live and it's really cool because they're big and they make a lot of noise and it kind of shakes the whole sky at night they light everything up which is like even cooler but this one was in the middle of the afternoon while I was working on my trailer and so off it goes into space and that's what it looks like when a billionaire shoots off great big rockets by your house that's one way of getting rid of that big thing <laughs> 